Yeah, you might be a bit hard to believe this, but I'm actually in Paradise. Yep, that's what they call this place. It's what the name the little town is called is Paradise. Now, it's only one road here, and maybe there's about 200 houses. And at first you think there's no problem with the rubbish, and then you start looking around, there is. Now, I'm on the football pitch here, in the, in the town, the main football pitch, and it's just covered in rubbish. So I don't know how they actually play the football or any games, but when you watch behind me as I'm walking, you'll see it's just all rubbish behind it. Now, the reason for this, the government's not put any bins out, and there's nowhere to put it anyhow if they do. This is a problem, and there's just no bins. So what you'll be able to do is they buy water, they buy fruit juices, they buy everything in plastic today, and there's just nowhere to put it. And uh, I'll just show you, you can keep looking behind me, and you'll see the rubbish. Now this is in the middle of nowhere, you're right in the jungle here. If you look at it, I'll put a picture of the map where it is. There's two roads that go right round the town, and you have to take a little back street to get in here. This is in the middle of the Amazon jungle, you could say, and look at the state of it. You know, I mean, it's everywhere, and this is a football pit. You know, and that's just as so you see when you come over here, you can see it better. It's all there. But, uh, you yeah, know, let's just look at the... That's where the goals are here. Okay, it's a bit like Old Trafford, right? It's full of rubbish. Ah, good joke. Manchester City fan getting him his own back. And then, you know, just here, you've got all this rubbish. And, uh, just talking about Manchester United and Manchester City, someone said that uh, Manchester United are now, uh, you know, not top dog in Manchester. Well, it's true, you're not. You've lost. Manchester City is a top team in Manchester now. Right, yeah, that's about football. Okay, yeah, all this rubbish around here. So, but who's at fault here? Well, it's got to be the government's got to do something. Even, you know, the government from Lima's got to do something. Okay, and uh, that's far. Well, I can say, and like I've said before, and I've shouted many times, you could be making roads out of this rubbish. It's better than destroying the environment. It's better than making more space in the jungle for putting your rubbish. Make roads out of it. And, uh, like I say, it's everywhere. I'll just, uh, this is the main football stand, a bit like Old Trafford again. There you see there, that's a football stand. They're just like Stratford End. There you are, that's it. There's no much different. But, uh, the trouble is, I take everything else, people are asleep today, always lying down, doing nothing. This is what's got to change, people got to be active. Hola amigo, como esta? Well, so if you just look around the stand here, just watch behind me as I'm walking past. You'll see all the rubbish. That's just down here, I don't know if you can actually see it, but I it's all down there. You can see it. It's all dumped here as well. I mean, this is around your look. Uh, yeah, just lots of rubbish. Now, I'll show you again. This plastic bottle can be reused to make this road like an asphalt road. It's as simple as that. Oh, where do I put it now? There's no bins, there's nothing here for me to put my bottles up if I use it.